Howdy everyone, Potcher here with an Age of Magic video, and in today's video we are going to beat the Golden Army team with Siegfried. In the last video I did the story, which got amazing reception. Thank you guys, I really didn't think it was going to be as awesome as well, as, as it was. You guys loved it, I hopefully can make a, another video like that in the future. And I still do need to do a proper guide video on that team, but uh, a lot of comments stated that there was a team stronger than the one in that video, stronger than a full Golden Army team, and that is Artis, Sacra. Tyros, Arjun, Argen, and um, Siegfried. Apparently that was a far more difficult team to beat. And to be honest, I couldn't figure out how to beat it. And someone in the community did link me um, a video on how they beat it. And they allowed me to make a video on it. So thank you to them. They did not want to be mentioned. However, they did want me to promote their clan, which I am more than happy to do. They are part of Jedi Knights. If you are interested in joining this clan, I believe it is part of an alliance, so there is a variation of clans. I have put the link to their Discord in the description below. They would prefer you enter their Discord, and you can find their information through there. So I'm happy to do that. Uh, so yeah, if you feel, feel free to go hit, hit them up. And uh, thank you again to the person who brought me this team that can beat the, uh, the Golden Army and Siegfried. It is very helpful. And lucky for us, we are able to share it with you guys, and hopefully it can help everyone out there. So sit back, enjoy, and let's beat these uh, these bad boys. Okay, going into battle, there are a few things we need to note. Number one is Sacrif is our number one target. We need to kill Sacrif. Okay, and now we are going to use Mark of the Arakon. Now, this does not have a 100% chance of working because we do not have five Arakins on the team. It does work 80% of the time, though, so pretty good odds, but RNG can bum you over. Next, we're using Forbidden Ritual to increase the initiative of our um, Arakan. And now we are going to attack Sacrif. We are not going to use our Decrease Accuracy ability because that is reserved specifically for um, Tyros. That is the only character we want to use it on. So we're going to go God Mode and then we're going to slap our uh, Sacrif here twice with a big old axe. Then we're going to come back out. We're going to absorb HP to get rid of the shield on all the enemies. Wonderful. And then we are going to... Ooh. Right, make sure you do not have decreased accuracy on your characters from artists. Riz of Blood to decrease the damage coming from the enemy. That is important as well. And now, what is it? Her, his abilities are not coming up yet. If the hell goes, this is duration. Okay, so we want to save that mark on him, okay? We do not want to trigger that yet. We want to use that when his abilities are about to come off cooldown. That way we can get really big decrease accuracy on him. That is super, super important. Okay, he is out. We're going to move on to our friend um, Artis here. He is our next target, okay? And now, 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 still two more turns. What do we want to do? What is your taunt? One turn, okay? And what is our... Okay, so everything is lined up perfectly. So we are just going to auto-attack this time. Okay, auto-attack. Uh, Siegfried, we are going to cast this ability now. Because it will still apply to Tyros when... Um... So, I'm getting so confused with names. Siegfried uses his taunt. Okay, we are going to heal up our allies. And then we are just going to auto-attack. We do not want to use the other ability because it doesn't work with... Uh... Uh, the, yeah. Okay, so now we are going to decrease accuracy. Wonderful. His accuracy is decreased. We're going to go into God Mode because he cannot do anything to us. You see, he misses all his abilities. And the good thing about God Mode as well is he cannot reduce our initiative. As you just saw, he used his Cyclone Strike. Did not affect our initiative whatsoever. And we are going to keep attacking our friend, Big Boy Artis here. Because that is all we need to do. We're going to absorb the HP of all the enemies. Beautiful, and now we are going to increase our initiative and apply anti heal. Ah, I was hoping we'd hit two targets there. Can we kill him here? We can. Beautiful. Ah, so good. Okay, we are going to move on to. We're going to just attack Argon until we can't because we critically struck him, and then we're going to move on to uh, Siegfried. We're going to leave um, Tyros to last because, to be honest, he's not really a threat. Unless, of course. No, he's still good. We can still attack him, unless, of course, the uh, mark of the Aricon does not hit. So now we will be able to... Do we want to yet? No, we're not. We're not going to do it yet. Okay, we are going to decrease the attack of the enemies, and we're just going to keep attacking, and we are going to not go into god mode, because we do not need to. 
All right, now we are going to decrease his accuracy. I'm going to use my Resurrect just because he hits Lucky for a little bit. Then we go back into our big boy mode. And then we should be able to kill Argon here. We've got a minute left. Of course, this battle will go faster for you guys because you're not going to be talking the whole time. Again, we're going to absorb all the HP of our enemies. And we are just going to keep attacking. There we go. We should be able to kill him here. We're going to use heal, get our defensive. He uses stellar rain, but that is not a big deal because we can increase our initiative. We take out the big tank, and now we are going to finish off by attacking Tyros. Tyros is a big threat. You can choose to take him out earlier if you want, but as a as you, as long as you can control him, there is no issue. There you go. And he finishes off with his passive triggering and a stellar rain. It can be three starred. It is amazing. I can't believe someone figured out how to do it. It is awesome. Thank you so much to the person who did it. Again, don't want to be mentioned, but I have promoted their clan. Um, the team is not 100%, as you can see in the clip I'm about to show you. Because if Tyros does get a lucky ability off or you, your cooldowns aren't lined up, it does bum you over. But the Siegfried Golden Army team can be beaten, and it can be three-star. So, awesome. Anyway, ladies and gents... Uh, thank you so much for watching. If you have any questions, feel free to leave a comment below. I'll answer to the best of my ability. And wherever you are in the world, until next time, please take care of yourself. Okay, we're going to increase the initiative of our characters. And then we are going to... We are going to use Black Sacrifice. Because I know Tyros is about to use Stellar Rain and One Shot Hour Lucky. And that is the worst thing that can happen. That is where fucking dog Tyros...